you guys had the game won and you come out for a timeout, you know he's going to be the guy that's going to take that shot. You know it. So what was going through your head and your, your team defensive strategy at that point? Well, um, the strategy was, which obviously Michael was able to, to get the ball anyway, but uh, Craig Elo was guarding him. And Larry Nance was the guy that was uh, guarding the inbounder. And so Lenny's thought process was, well, let's, Larry's going to, as soon as they hand the ball in, he's going to leave his guy and try to go deny Michael the ball, you know, kind of double team before he catches it kind of deal. Don't let him catch it. Well, Mike, you know, Michael was able to kind of go out and then come back and catch it and put him in a one-on-one -on -one situation against Craig Elo. And so Michael in two dribbles was able to get to his spot. Whereas looking at it in hindsight, it probably would have been better to just kind of let Michael push it out, let him maybe catch it closer to half court, and now maybe double team to give yourself a better opportunity. Uh, hindsight's always 20-20. But, uh, you know, Michael was just a great player, and, you know, he wasn't going to, you know, he beat that double team to get the ball and then just made, made a great play. It was unreal. I mean, he literally had to hang in the air. I mean, Craig Elo did a fabulous job getting back into play. Michael raises up, Craig comes by, Michael just hangs and lets him come by. So, <laughs> shot go, it, it was it was incredible, incredible shot. 